notes are co-tenancies in this, a notarized note which states that they have been threatened by their landlord with eviction unless they get us people to leave. Us people to leave. That's stuck in my head. Us people to leave. And uh, therefore they have been instructed to do whatever is in their power. And that includes harassment, provocation, even though they've been told that we're both ill, that, my, uh, that Timothy has PTSD. Uh, rules of these games are no matter how much they provoke you, never aggress. Stand your ground firmly, dodge if you must. I've learned all this. But uh, just like uh, they told me after they, while I was still in 7G, when uh, the Midtown landlord. Um, tried to discredit us, or the organization with whom he worked. Um, yes, and the doctors thought that I needed um, care. I really did, however, I was suffering from it's called post-traumatic stress disorder, ongoing traumatic stress disorder. No mental impairment. My uh, perception was clear. So was his. What this country suffers from is the disease of the soul. and the spirit. Now, they're trying to get us people to leave. Us, as in U.S. capitalized, get us people to leave. Oh, they're stuck with me. Um, when we had to call 911 to get the electric back on, the neighbor woman has put out an open complaint against Timothy. She claims she that he assaulted her. I did not even know what it was. Her husband was talking about when he told me to be careful vis-a-vis -vis Timothy and his wife. Then I remembered after um, quite a few talks with Timothy to see what that was all about. Uh, it was on the day the uh, construction uh, agent came to the door, pounded on the door. Our co-tenants have decided that they have better chances siding with their landlord who I believe may have already tried to trick them out of their apartment but they may know him better than I I really don't know but uh, they said they were going to rent a room and give up their lease so that their landlord could renovate here his agent had told me that there's someone else who wants to move in here already. That everything is going to be remodeled and that everyone is going to have to go. They did not believe me. They listened to the management. 
I didn't tell them initially about the visit of the con con uh, contractor. I should have earlier, I have told them by now, but they still think that this is all just put on for show to get us out and that they have the better standing. Maybe that's so, I have no idea. Um, we had asked them insistently when we uh, first spoke to them to please tell us now if there is any chance that uh, staying for the long term here might not be possible because we are both very sick and we have moved a lot of times and uh, we do not have the strength to do it yet, yet another time. We are looking for something for the long term. So uh, please to inform us of the situation, you know, as to how long the lease is good, etc. Um, I sensed some apprehension from the man. I thought it was perhaps because we uh, asked the same question so many times over. Also, of course, uh, see, the problem is this. Had he told us, probably we would have moved on, looked somewhere else. We didn't want a three-month rental because we need to settle down somewhere for a while. Um, when we called 911, oh yes, what happened was when the altercation happened with the construction guy who wanted to rip the walls out here, um, which supposedly would only take one day, they told us, which is a lie because construction work takes considerably longer than that, and the job that was proposed cannot be done in a day. It was also about Timothy's plants. So they made now complaint after complaint. I took the rap for the plants. It was nothing. <laughs> um, but this is false accusation of an assault. That's more serious. So Timothy got arrested for this this morning when the uh, same cops also uh, put the electric back on to me. He's very ill, he was sweating profusely and I don't know if he'll even survive this. He will, but every time we get beaten down like that, our spirit dies a little more. That's just what they want because they want us on the dark side. That's how the dark side gets in. Um, anyhow. Oh, the altercation, supposed altercation. After we explained to the management and the contractor guy, a big, strong guy, is, uh, you know, rips out uh, radiators and whatever, uh, could do it by hand. <laughs> big, strong guy. 